Hello everyone, I am Dr. Godin Raman. In this section, we are going to discuss with joint probability density function, marginal probability distribution function, conditional probability distribution function type of problem. If the joint probability density function of a two dimensional random variable xy is given by a function of x comma y equal to x square plus xy by 3, the range x range 0 to 1, y range 0 to 2, find the probability x greater than 1 by 2, y probability of y less than x, then probability of x less than 1 by 2, y less than 1 by 2 and probability of y less than 1 by 2 given x less than 1 by 2. Now, the problem is continuous problem because of the ranges are given. First of all, find the value of x greater than 2 and before that, if any single variable is given, single functions are given, it's uh, uh, first of calculate the probability of marginal function, marginal distribution function. It is easy for solving the problem. So, first of all, find the marginal density function. Marginal density function of x. So, this is nothing but f of x integral minus infinity to plus infinity f of x comma y dy the derivative dy when f of x to calculate and the limits while range 0 to 2 f of x comma y value x square x y by 3 into dy therefore now integrate with respect to y x square constant dy integration y plus x by 3 constant y integration y square by 2 0 to 2. So, now substitute upper limit where to substitute here y and here y substitute therefore x square 2 plus x by 6 2 square upper limit minus of lower limit 0. Now, this term 2x square and then to cancel this 3 plus 2x by 3. This is our f of x, x range 0 to 1 by 2, sorry 0 to 1. So, this is a marginal function x. And then marginal function y. Marginal function for y. Now marginal function is nothing but f of y to calculate f of y equal to minus infinity to plus infinity f of x comma y into dx. If f of y meant dx, f of x means dy. The range x range 0 to 1 then f of x y value x square plus x y by 3 into dx. Here x is the variable x square integration x q by 3 then y by 3 constant so x integration x square by 2 0 to 1. Substitute upper limit and the lower limit. So upper limit to substitute where in terms of x here x so upper limit 1 by 3 plus y by 6 constant 1 square minus lower limit. So, this is a term 1 by 3 plus y by 6 the range y 2 0 to 2. So, this is a f of y. Now, what is the next question? So, first, first x greater than 1 by 2 x greater than 1 by 2. So, x greater than 1 by 2, 1 by 2 to infinity f of x dx. So, the infinity is nothing but the maximum range of x, maximum range of x 1. So, 1 by 2 to 1 f of x dx. The f of x value, see marginal function value, 2x square 2x square plus 2x by 3 into dx. So, when I integrate this 2x cube by 3 and 2 by 3 x square by 2 0 to sorry 1 by 2 to 
1. So substitute upper limit 1, so 2 by 3 1 cube plus this 2 cancel 1 by 3 1 square upper limit minus of lower limit 2 by 3 1 by 2 power 3 plus 1 by 3 1 by 2 power 2. So this term 2 by 3 plus 1 by 3 and then 1 2 will be cancel minus the 2 1 2 cancel 1 by 4 1 by 12 then minus 1 by 12 so this 4 3 so 12. Now when I LCM taking LCM so 2 by 3 so when I am taking 12 is LCM this is a 4 8 4 minus 1 minus 1 now 12 so 10 by 12 5 by 6 when x greater than 1 by 2. Then next y less than x probability of y less than x. So when y less than x is a double integration because of x range and y range a double integral of x f of x comma y d y dx the y range should be 0 to maximum x because y maximum x minimum 0 to 2 but maximum x is 0 to x x range 0 to 1 now substitute f of x 0 to 1 y 0 to x then f of x y is nothing but x square plus x y by 3 d y d x d y d x now integration first with respect to x first integration with respect to y now y means x constant x 0 to 1 when I integrate x square d y x square y then x by 3 constant y square by 2 0 to x into dx so substitute upper limit where to substitute upper limit y where y to substitute upper limit x 0 to 1 x square x plus x by 6 x square upper limit minus of lower limit 0 then dx therefore the term is nothing but x cube x cube plus x cube by 6 into dx when i simplify this 7 x cube 6x plus 7 x cube by 6 dx So, once again I will check. So, 0 to x, x square into y, x by 3, y square by 2. So, when I substituted x, x cube, x cube by 6 is correct. Fine. So, now to integrate again with respect to x, 7 by 6 constant x power 4 by 4. 0 to 1 therefore 7 by 6 1 power 4 by 4 minus 0 upper limit lower limit so 7 by 24 so this is a value x y less than x and then next question probability of x less than 1 by 2 y less than 1 by 2 therefore x range y range if first already taken here x first so whatever you should take it not issue if y equal to 0 to 1 by 2 x is equal to 0 to 1 by 2 
then x square plus x y by 3 d x d y. So, first integrate with respect to x y 0 to 1 by 2 x cube by 3 y by 3 constant x square by 2 0 to 1 by 2 into d y. So, substitute upper limit lower limit where in x term therefore, y 0 to 1 by 2 when I substituted 1 by 2 cube by 3 y by 6 1 by 2 square upper limit lower limit 0 into d y. Therefore, y 0 to 1 by 2 this is a 1 by 8. So, 1 by 24 plus 4 24 y by 24 d y. Now, I will take 1 by 24 out y 0 to 1 by 2 1 plus y d y. When I integrate 1 into d y d y integration y y d y integration y square by 2 0 to 1 by 2. So, substitute upper limit and lower limit. So, 1 by 4 1 by 2 plus 1 by 2 square by 2 minus 0 plus 0 upper limit and then lower limit. Therefore, this term 1 by 2 plus 1 by 8 1 by 4 by 2 1 by 8. When I am taking the LCM 8 LCM. So, 4 then 2 by 8, 4 by 4 5 by 8. Therefore, 5 by 24. So, 5 by 1 92 x less than 1 by 2 y less than 1 by 2. The next one y less than 1 by 2 given x less than 1 by 2 it is a conditional probability. What is the condition? A given B is nothing but A intersection B probability of B. So, this is our conditional probability. Similarly, write this y or x whatever. So, x less than 1 by 2 comma y less than 1 by 2 or y less than 1 by 2 comma x less than 1 by 2. So, not issue to changes. Then divide by x less than 1 by 2. Now, substitute the value x less than 1 by 2 y less than 1 by 2 is nothing but 5 by 192 divide by x less than 1 by 2 value x greater than 1 by 2 5 by 6 x greater than 1 by 2. So, this is a greater than I think what is the question everything less than or greater than sorry this is a less than question what is the question less than. So, y less than x less than ok fine. So, x less than 1 by 2 So, x less than 1 by 2 to calculate or 1 minus of x greater than 1 by 2 total probability 1 then subtract 1 minus x greater than 1 by 2 5 by 192 divide by 1 minus x greater than 1 by 2 value 5 by 6. This is a 5 by 192 into 6 minus 1 1 by 6 6. So, when I cancel this 32. So, 5 by 32 when the probability conditional probability y less than 1 by 2 given x less than 1 by 2. So, this is a continuous problem joint probability density function and then marginal probability distribution function and conditional probability 
distribution function. Thank you.